right, welcome. Day five, control. Come on and uh, stand up. Let's start today standing. Feet hips within distance, body relaxed, eyes closed down. And all I want you to do is just to drop into your own physical body. Get all the moving and shaking out. Mm. Deeper inhales and exhales. As we land here, I notice how good it feels to stand. You are alive. We're getting energy, raising energy in the body just by standing up. And as always, I'm going to place hands over the heart center. There's an understanding, a deep understanding here when you enter and lead with this center, the heart center. There's a sense of control that you're releasing, that you don't need. It's not a necessity to control every single aspect of your life. And I know right now in these uncertain times, it can feel like there's a need to, to control, to grip, to attach. We're going to practice today that idea of letting go, releasing. So from this space, again, calm breaths in, calm breaths out. I am calm and relaxed. I am calm and relaxed. I am calm and relaxed. Just feeling that taking over now as you turn more and more inwards. Together, taking a deep breath in and a full breath out. Good. Release the arms, open the eyes up, shake it out. Come to the top of your mat. Feet hips width and distance, legs bent. Take a big breath in as you sweep the arms up and folding with bent legs. And then just move here side to side with bent legs. I don't need them to be straight right now. I'm not trying to impress anyone or anything outside of me. I'm just moving side, side, side. That includes the head here. Side, side, side. Slow or fast. One leg straightens. One leg stays bent. I might come up onto the toes. I can rotate here. One heel down, one heel up. I can walk the hands out further here to get more support, especially if you're tight in the hamstrings. This really helps. And from your side to side to side, all right? And I come back to center slowly, fingertips on something, floor, blocks, whatever. Legs still bent, inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, fold. Press down, inhale, rise all the way up. Palms meet, center of the chest. Release the arms, inhale, stretch. Dive forward, exhale, fold. Chest on the rise. And again, exhale, folding in. Inhale, rise up. Palm center of the chest. Arms release. Reach. Fold as you exhale. Chest lifting. And let's step back to a downward facing dog. Step back. Now, if you need to just settle onto the knees, settle onto the knees. If you're okay in a downward dog, just pedal side to side. If you're on the knees, maybe just move side to side. Wherever you'd like to be, eventually, if you're on all fours, come meet in downward dog. Move the head around, just a few breaths here. <sighs> Feet and hands rooted into the floor. All right, now, next inhale, come on forward, top of a plank. I'm gonna ask you to hold right here. Hold, eyes at the elbows, facing forward. So that means externally rotate your arms. Right? Right. And from here, I'm just going to hold. Breathe. Gaze it down. Notice the tendency. If you need to bring the knees down, bring the knees down, right? This isn't a competition. I just want to engage your abdominal muscles. Get them firing. Build strength in the legs and in the arms. You're holding up your body. This is your body weight. And it can be used to build massive strength. Release control. The need to control this. Just breathe. Three, two, 
One, come down onto the knees, stretch back into a child's pose. As high up or as far back as your hips need to go. My hands I usually use as a little place to rest, stacked on top of one another. Side to side. Okay, good. Stretch the hands out in front of you, arms straight. Come on up, all fours. Inhale. Downward dog as you exhale. Come forward, high plank. Bring the knees down, bend the arms, chest to the floor. Small lift, inhale. Lowering down, exhale. Small lift, inhale. Lowering down, exhale. Just small lifts, doesn't take much. Inhale. Exhale, lower. Now this time as you lift, inhale. I'm gonna press back to all fours. Stretch back to a downward dog. Lift up high onto your toes, but zip the legs together first. Lift up high. Inhale, bend your legs, and as you exhale, just tiptoe the feet all the way up to the hands. Chest on the rise, inhale. Folding back in on the exhale. Legs bent, inhale, rise all the way up. Palms meet on the exhale. Release the arms. Inhale, stretch. Don't think about it. No mind. Exhale, fold. No need to control this, right? Let your body do the inhale, lift. The moving. Exhale, step back. Downward dog. Forward high plank. Inhale. Knees lowering, arms bending. Exhale. Small lift. Breathing in. All fours on the exhale. And then two of your downward dog. One breath here in. And one breath out. Zip the legs together, lift high. Look forward, lightly step to the top. Again, no hurry, no rush. Inhale, lift. Exhale, fold. Press down, inhale, rising up, stretch. Palms meeting, center of the chest. Good, release the arms, stretch them up. Fold forward, exhale. Chest on the rise. Step back, downward dog. All the way back, forward, inhale. Modified or not, you choose. Knees down or not, lower. Anchor down to come up. All the way up to an up dog if you like. And then stretch back, downward facing dog. Step your right foot forward, no thought about it. On an inhale, take the arms, slowly reach them up. Hold or deepen your lunge as you exhale. Breathe in to look up. Open up, warrior two, as you exhale. Back heel down, arms outstretched. Take a deep breath in. Hold or deepen. Flip your right palm. Inhale, reverse. Hands to the floor as you exhale. Now listen, back heel high. Lower this left knee down. Open the right arm up. Inhale. Hold as you exhale. Inhale. Bring this hand down as you exhale. Straighten this leg. Step back. Inhale. Three-legged downward dog. Simply lower your leg. Exhale. Forward. Plank. Chaturanga. Exhale. Let's come on up. Breathing in. And then all the way back. Breathing out. Now I'm stepping the left foot forward. Again, you don't have to think about it. Get a good base. When you've got that good base, inhale the arms up. Hold or deepen your lunge. Look up, inhale. Let's open up warrior two on the exhale. Don't worry about checking your feet or position. Just land as you exhale. Breathe here. Hold. I'm gonna take this left palm up now. Reverse, inhale. Bring the hands to the floor on the exhale. Now remember, I'm not in a hurry. Back heel's high. I'm gonna take this right knee down. Open up the arm. Take a deep breath in. Hold breath out. Breath in. Left hand coming down as you breathe out. Now again, I'm not in any hurry. You don't need to control this. Slowly lift the leg. Inhale. Pressing back as best you can. Three-legged dog. Exhale, lower that leg. Forward. Modified or not, I'll modify this round. 
small lift or a big lift and all the way back take one long breath here and then let it go let's go through one more round zip the legs up inhale lift look forward travel to the top of your mat anyway like lift the chest and then fold pressing down rise up palms together and through release and reach fold chest on the rise downward facing dog step it back high plank modified or not lower coming up and through and all the way back right foot forward inhale the arms up opening up back heel down smooth inhale reach up hands to the floor exhale listen back heel is high inhale open the right arm up to the ceiling exhale right hand down three-legged dog inhale lower the leg down high plank control inhale up exhale back left foot forward inhale the arms up. exhale to open no thought inhale reverse as you exhale let the hands come down back heel high inhale left arm opens exhale like a wave let it come back down and then you kick back inhale three-legged dog with the exhale it slowly lowers 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 lowers, lowers. inhale high exhale down inhale up. exhale back with bent legs walk the hands and feet towards one another they meet right in the middle of the mat and with those bent legs i'm going to take the hands to the thighs and roll up one vertebrae one vertebrae had the very last thing to come up and as it does keep the eyes closed as you get all the way up standing here mountain pose all this strength and with the control of your mind your breath and your body over the last 15 minutes or so you've released control of the conscious mind attempting to direct. So stand in that for a moment. And if you're like me, you can place a hand over the heart. And now nothing exists except for this heart space. Breathing in and breathing out. with you. Take this strength, take this direction, take this leading with the heart and use it as momentum as you move through the rest of your day. And always in a state of gratitude to yourself. We'll seal this practice together. Deep breath in. Letting go on the breath out. At least physically, Open the eyes when you're ready. Rub your forehead or your eyes. Move your body around. That, that is the practice for today. Use it. I thank you. Very excited to see you tomorrow. And that is the practice. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and to sign up for notifications when new videos become available. Thank you so much.